May all beings be happy. May all beings be healthy. May all beings be free from harm. May all beings awaken. Welcome to another Geek Audio mini podcast. I pray that you and yours are safe and comfortable, free from economic hardship, and able to get out and do whatever it is you want within the limitations of the universal precept of do as little harm as possible. So today we have another memory from the Haiku Zendo Chronicles uh, in Los Altos. Haiku Zendo was in Los Altos, and, um, and before it was it was the Los Altos Zendo, but then they built Zendo in the garage with seventeen seats, like uh, seventeen syllables in a haiku poem. And it became the Haiku Zendo, and now it's Kanando in Mountain View. So uh, this, and it was published, Haiku Zendo, Haiku Zendo Chronicles, was published in 1973. And uh, so this memory is from Phil Olson. My favorite memory of Suzuki Roshi is of meeting him for the first time face to face. I was a brand new student attending my first session and feeling very unsure of myself in the midst of the strange Zen rituals. When I came before Roshi to have the private interview called Doksan, I didn't even know how to get down on my knees to make the customary bow before him. Roshi saw the difficulty I was having and got up himself to demonstrate the bow for me. He made a full bow at my feet. Then I practiced several bows in front of him. After that, we sat down and I asked about the Zen posture. You have not yet learned how we put strength in our stomach, he said. Again, he got up from his cushion and came around to show me how to sit correctly in Zazen. First, he adjusted my own posture and then he sat down in front of me and demonstrated the Zazen posture and the way of breathing himself. Watching Suzuki Roshi paying such careful attention to his breathing, I no longer saw Zen practice as something strange or separate from, from my own life. And upon leaving Roshi's room, I found a bow to be the most natural way of expressing my deepest feelings to him. Well, thank you, Phil Olson. That's very good. Hmm. This has been a Cuke Audio mini podcast. I'm DC coming to you from Sleepy Sanur with Dog at Bandita, Feline Cuchita, and dear lovely Katrinka. And we're wishing you and yours and all of us a grand awakening.